Pew, 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 pew. Hello, hello everyone, this is Narvin here of course, and I have a little challenge. Uh, I saw Relaxing M post this challenge, and apparently a bunch of other YouTubers have done it, but I haven't really seen anybody. Uh, he went with the Olympia, I decided to go with the M14, but it's a pretty straightforward challenge. You start on Bus Depot, round 20, stay in the first room. And it went really well actually, I didn't even really have to try very hard on this actually this was first try and it kind of just worked out and I was like huh I was expecting that to be a little harder than that but with the zombies coming through the windows all at once like this it's pretty easy to group them up I actually got kind of lucky in a couple little spots but I grouped them right on up and didn't have any trouble after that and there was a couple spots where you know you take a couple random hits from the walkers or whatnot but other than that it's pretty straightforward you just group them up turn shoot with the M14 reminds me of a uh, Ascension first room challenge days. Just a lot of spam in your gun. Um, I'm not really sure if the Olympia or the M14 is better to use. I just like the M14 better. I like spamming the trigger. The Olympia is just bang bang reload, bang bang reload, and that just gets really old really fast. So I prefer the Olymp or the M14. And actually, the M14 upgrade is, is awesome. Uh, when I did around 30 plus with three players on Nuketown. I was just running in the middle with the M14 upgraded, and it, that's all I used pretty much the entire round 33 plus, I think it was, to 38. So, I mean, I think it still takes off heads, and it still works pretty damn well, so, especially with double tap. But anyways, I'm probably just going to let this game play out. I don't really have much to commentate over it. It was a pretty simple, straightforward challenge, and yeah, if you guys have any other challenges like this, or I should... Or any other suggestions for things to try? I'd like to try some. I want to get some four-player challenges going. I definitely want to do a di diner roof challenge run, and I got a couple other little rooms I want to try to camp in. See how far we can go with four. Most likely four players. I think four players is the most intense and best to play. So we'll see how that goes. But like I said, I'm just gonna let this play out, and you can see how it goes. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoy. And see you later.